What's up, you stupid fucking mother fucker bitch fucking idiot? And welcome back to Fine Wine Wine Review. It's the only place on YouTube where you can see me discussing the Palestine Israeli conflict. No, it's not. It's the only place on YouTube where you can see me drinking fine wine. Um, and today we've got a Sauvignon Blanc by The Ned from Marlborough, New Zealand. And you know what? I'm already skeptical of this because um, contrary to popular belief, New Zealand doesn't actually exist. When you leave Australia on a plane, they just like fucking like fly you around in a circle and you land back in Australia. And that's why they have like the same accent and shit because it's like the same place. But anyway, I won't get into that now. I'll let you guys do your own research on this. And I'm going to crack open this Sauvignon Blanc 2019 vintage. Um, I don't know a whole lot about wine, but I know that if it's older than a year old, it's probably good. I think that's what they say. Um, screw top. I'm more of a cork man myself, but, you know, I'm not going to judge them for their packaging um, choices. Because at the end of the day, it's about the wine and not the packaging. That's what most sommeliers will tell you. Um, so I'm going to pour this up, give you a little ASMR, because I know that's what you're all here for at the end of the day. Um, yeah, this smells like a good Sauvignon Blanc. Um, I don't really fuck with Sauvignon Blanc, I cannot lie. But, um, you know, I thought, why not? It smells pretty good. I'm going to go in for my first sip. It's wine, I'll tell you that much. Um, let me have another one. Hmm, definitely getting some grape notes. Um, there's a, a slight effervescence to it. I'm not sure if that's on purpose or if it's just because I poured it a little too vigorously. But um, yeah, the grape notes definitely come through. Um, let me take a look at the back to see if they give me any hints. Um, delightfully ripe aromas of gooseberry. I taste the gooseberry now that they've mentioned it. And white peach. Don't really taste the white peach. Cannot lie. Um, refreshing notes of kaffir lime. I have no fucking clue what a kaffir lime is. But let's let's go have a little third sip. Feeling a bit cheeky today. And um, we'll see if we can taste the kaffir lime. There's a there's a slight acidity to it, but it's a lot smoother than your average Sauvignon Blanc. Um, I quite like this. It's a good wine. Um, I feel like it would go quite well with, um, hmm, very good question. What would it go well with? I'm feeling like something Italian could go well with a pizza, could go well with a pasta. Oh, I'm feeling this would be paired nice with carbonara, actually, if you don't eat meat then you're fucked. You can't enjoy this wine properly. I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. All in all, decent Sauvignon Blanc. Better than your average Sauvignon Blanc. This bottle was like £11, so a bit more on the pricey side, but um, fucking nice wine at the end of the day. Feeling a solid 8.5 out of 10 for the Ned um, Sauvignon Blanc. It loses points for... What does it lose points for? Let me... Go for a fourth sip. Actually, you know what? It gets a nine. That's just nice. It's smooth. Doesn't have too much of a bite to it. I could see myself downing this whole glass on camera right now. Delicious. Yeah, that's about it for me. I'll um see you guys in the next video. Um, yeah subscribe fucking um hit the like button every time you like your balls will drop one meter so leave this video enough likes and you'll be able to um <laughs> what a stupid <laughs> um, i'm gonna cut that out actually no i can't cut that out now <laughs> um <laughs> yeah for real um you're also Oh, true, true. You guys are lucky. <laughs>
Um, yeah, also, uh, the, my album came out last week. Um, I'll leave a link in the description to the like Spotify, Apple Music, iTunes, um, uh, SoundCloud and shit, Bandcamp if you want to pay seven quid for it. That would mean a lot to me. Um, and yeah, leave a comment telling me how much you love me because, you know, it's always nice. It's always nice to feel a bit of love sometimes. Um, that's it from me. That's it from Josh. He didn't say anything, but I promise you it's th that that's it from him. Um, <laughs> all right, bye. <laughs>